Natalia Zarkova is one of the few women who managed to enter the prestigious Russian Academy of Arts in Moscow. Until 10 years ago, she only painted for the upper class. One day she came to Rome planning to stay only three months, but ended up never leaving. The reason for this extension was John Paul II, who she says changed her life. Personally, John Paul II changed my life when I met him during my three months stay. I found something special in him. I think he spoke with divine providence. I am very grateful to have met this amazing Pope. In 2000, it was proposed that she paint a portrait of John Paul II for his 80th birthday, and also to celebrate the Jubilee. What this artist did not expect was that her picture would become the official portrait of the Pope. For me, it was quite an honor because it was like a dream come true. It was also a great responsibility to make this portrait of the Pope. I completed it, and now it has become his official portrait. I'm very glad I had the opportunity. I had a private audience when I presented the picture, and the Pope was very happy. He spoke in Russian to me and asked, are you Russian? Long live Russian art. He told me to continue painting. Natalia Zarkova has made five portraits of John Paul II. In addition to the portraits of the Pope, she has done several related paintings, like this one of the Virgin of Hope, which she gave to John Paul II after adding the luminous mysteries to the rosary, as well as this one of the Last Supper, which reflects the same search for peace and love that he proclaimed. The color palette that best suits him has been made very clear. His official portrait is done mostly in green, which symbolizes hope. But overall, I would say that there are three main colors, green as an expression of hope, and white and red as the colors of purity, faith, and love. Zarkova is an Orthodox Christian and ensures that this has never affected her work in portraying different figures in the Catholic Church. I feel that through my art, I serve as a bridge. I'm very happy. I love the environment in which I move. I have many friends and I feel very appreciated. She says that in Rome she found what she was looking for, and with her brush, hopes to share in John Paul II's mission to achieve peace. Zarkova hopes to stay in Rome for as long as possible.